is a good name? My name is Ernest Abraham Melinda. I'm from Kerala. Okay. Why did you join ISBA? Well, obvious reason I wanted to do my MBA and uh, I guess it, it was part of my life and you know, God wanted me to do something good. I joined Wonderful. ISBA. How is the experience at ISBA? Uh, if you had asked me two years back about the same question, I would have said, ah, uh, not that great, but then then the moment, now that the time is done for 2012 14 batch, I miss every single day of my lectures and every single day with my friends, Udit, Prashant, Bhushan. A lot to be missed because school, I mean, like the college life won't return back once again. And this probably is my last time that ever I would ever do in education. And it has been very memorable and I would always relish every single moment that I spend over here. Wow. Okay, different eyes be made in your life. Well, I was not that kind of an outgoing person. No, I was an outgoing person. They, what do you call, see a little more of a good, a better personality in me. Wherein, uh, I started polishing my language when I put across certain, what do you call, points of mind towards other people. In a way, I made even more better friends than what I made in back in law, you know? So, I'm happy. Wow. How is the faculty at ISP? No, it's been amazing and I, I'm really thankful to all my lecturers for, you know, bearing with me and, you know, teaching me good stuff. Yeah, stay blessed. Thank you. How are your friends at ISPR? What type of friends do you have? Ones that I have are like very limited, but then the limited ones are crazy ones. So, me, Prashant, Udit, and Boshan, we four been hanging together since the very single first day of our college life. And I mean, like, we did everything together, man. There's nothing that, there's not a single day that is nothing memorable for us. You know, like, every single day has been memorable, and we don't regret what we've done so far. We were like, we had a balanced life, oh yeah. So, name it studies, yes, we were good. Name it a word. <laughs> so, it was awesome with my friends over here. What is so unique about ISBR? Yeah, they took a person like me and polished me into an amazing diamond. That's enough. And uh, when you go to a mine, you don't get the correct, the polished form, form of diamond thing. So, ISBR, what it does is they go to a market, take the worst of all people, but then the moment they go out, they come out like dirt, but go out like a filter diamond. So, it's amazing. It's very unique of this college. Wow. Okay, where are you working now? Right now, I'm working with Team Lees as a team supervisor. So, I'm into project management. You call me a project manager there. Okay, how has ISBR helped you to reach your goal? As I mentioned, they did in fact help me seeding a professional, what do you call it, a seed into me wherein it grew. They you know, nourished me. They told, okay, what needs to be done next. They guided me all throughout my, from the very first day onwards till the time I go, go, went out. Even after leaving the college, there were a lot of support from my lecture, especially please and Like There were times when I felt really down, like, you know, so I really frustrated with work. I want to come back to my college life. So, there's always been lecturers support even after you leave college. It's not just that you know, come pay the money, get your studies and go back. No one's going to stay in touch with you. No. That's one another thing of uniqueness of ISBR. All your lecturers stay in touch. How do you feel about the facilities that ISBR provided? They have provided whatever they could from whatever they see. I mean, like, yeah, what the, whatever the fees was for us, they provide everything in that. It's a very clean budget and they, do, they met our necessities. That's all that matters for us. Wow. Can you tell me something about your hostel life? Hostel life, wow, those days are like crazy. Nine o'clock is a cut off date, so the coffee was nine o'clock. So after nine o'clock, when our life starts, I get something to eat. Me being a big person, I need a lot of food. So my hunger starts even after I have my first round of dinner. I would, my second round of dinner will start around 10 o'clock. So the hostel life was really awesome. Not, not a single day that we slept earlier than two o'clock. So amazing. Wow, oh, well, it was very nice talking to you. Same, yeah, thank you.